Are you ignorant, brethren? For I speak to men who know the law, that the law has dominion over man for so long time as he liveth. For the woman that has a husband is bound by law to the husband while he liveth. But if he, the husband, die, she is discharged from the law of the husband. So then if the husband liveth, she be joined to another man, she shall be called an adulteress. But if the husband die, she is free from the law, so that she is no adulteress, though she be joined to another man. Wherefore, my brethren, ye also are made dead to the law through the body of Christ, that ye should be joined to, to another, even to him who was raised from the dead, that we might bring forth fruit unto God. For when we were in the flesh, the sinful passions which were through the law wrought in our members to bring forth fruit unto death. But now we have been discharged from the law, having died to that wherein we were held so that we serve in newness of the spirit and not oldness of the letter. What shall we say then in the law of sin? God forbid, how be it, and I had not known sin except through the law for I had known covering except the law had said those shall not covet but sin find an occasion wrought in me through the commandments of all manner of coveting far apart from the law sin is dead and I was alive apart from the law once but when the commandments came sin revived and I died and the commandments which was unto life, this is this I found to be unto death. For sin find an occasion through the commandments beguiled me, and through it slew me. So that the law is holy, and the commandments holy, and the righteousness and good. Then did then that which is good become death unto me? God forbid. But sin that is might shown to be sin by work and death to me through that which is good, that through the commandment sin might become exceedingly sinful. For we know that the law is spiritual, but I am carnal, sold under sin, for that which I do not know. For not what I would that I do I practice, but what I hate that I do. But if what I would not that I do, I consent unto the law that is good. So now it is no more that I do it, but sin which dwelleth in me. For I know that in me, that is, in my flesh dwelleth no good thing, for to will is present with me. But to do that which is good is not. For the good which I do not, but the evil which I would not, that I practice. But if what I would not that I do, it is no more that I do it, but sin which dwelleth in me. I find then that the law, that to me who would do good, evil is present. For I delight in the law of God after the inward man, but I see the difference law in the members warning against the law of my mind and bringing me into captivity under the law of sin which is in my members. Wretch man that I am, who shall deliver me out of this body of this death? I thank God through Jesus Christ our Lord. So then, I of myself, with the mind indeed, serve the law of God, but with the flesh the law of sin. This was the book of Romans chapter 7.